phone again. Well, this is the only time I was supposed to be on the Um which I couldn't even rehearse because of all the extra. Oh, you, Jackman, where are you? Yes, Gina's car is is there waiting for her. <laughs> Just wait there. It's wait time. Yes. Okay, I gotta make sure the car is there for Mr. Rivera. <laughs> Anyway, okay, um, let me get this over with as quick as I can. Um, I want to thank, of course, you know, everybody for coming. It's been educational, informative, fun, everything. And this is what we do here at Dances Over 40. You know, we reconnect with old friends, we find new ones, and we gather so much information about our history, our legacy, and our lives through this building process that I just wish we could videotape every rehearsal. I mean, you don't know what it's like to have Carol Lawrence in your own apartment acting out West Side Story, her part, and Jerry Robbins. Oh, no! Ah! <laughs> I wanted to videotape it. It was wonderful. Priceless. Priceless. Um, obviously, thank you to Carol for co-hosting. This has been wonderful. And thank you so much, Harvey, for moderating. And for Miss Rivera to come from another gig at Barnes & Noble, right to here. Her show just ended you know, last uh, night ago. You know, thank you so much for coming. Oh, and doing this for us. You know, I really appreciate it. And anyway, um, thank you, everybody else here. Uh, and I thank you for your support of Dancers Over 40, and all of you for the commitment to helping us. Um, and all of our panelists, thank you wherever you are. I want you to come up. So get ready, panelists, to come up on stage. I want you all out here. Um, <coughs> and, and we should do this whole number. Our dancers, we'll try and do that whole number, as I said, at our concert. Special thanks to Liza, because we could not have done it without Liza Gennaro. Yeah. 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 And thank you for allowing us to share these memories about our time. Yeah. And I need to thank Ed Gaines for the use of the house, which he donated for free here at this house. And, and to my board of directors, thank you for trying to keep me sane, but it ain't going to work. Um, <laughs> um, and as I quote from my favorite show, from my favorite character, I simply cannot do it alone. We simply cannot do it alone. You know, we need all of your help and your support to become members of Dancers Over 40. I got a call this morning on the Dancers Over 40 hotline. He said, hello, uh, I found your wallet in our cab yesterday. Please call me. I wasn't in the cab yesterday. So I called the man back, very nice man, Assad. I said, Assad, hi, thank you for calling, but I wasn't in the cab. W what's the name in it? Oh, I do not know, but there was a card inside. It was membership to Dancers Over 40? <laughs> I said, oh, I'm the president. You can tell me, who is it? Oh, it's uh, Mr. George Marcy. <laughs> Our board member, George Marcy, and West Side Story Alum. I said, Georgie, your, your wallet's in the cab. So if he didn't have his Dancers Over 40 membership card, he would never have his wallet. Well, anyway, so we have our membership to help us, and we also have a grant from Broadway Care as our first grant. But we are going to do fundraising, we are going to do grant writing, and that's where we need to go, because we need to depend on more than just our members, but they're very important, because we've been growing every year. Every year we get more and more members, which is terrific. Um, so, uh, let's see. Oh, our next event, we can actually announce today, because it's all together, all set. Our next event is right across the street at Swing 46, 349 West 46th Street is our first ever Dances Over 40 Legacy Award. We're finally going to be, to be honoring our own members for their commitment to dance in their field and their commitment to Dances Over 40. And our first honorees are, some of them are here, the lovely Jen Z. Delap, <laughs> Nicole Barnes, in the back, hello, Nicole Barnes, okay. Billy Mahoney is flying in from Kansas City, Missouri, um, Marge Beto, and Marge Champion. And next year we're on the men of Dancers Over 40. So join us December 13th, 2 to 5 p.m. at Swing, right across the street. All the information is in your program. Also, how to join is in your program. As many of you did join tonight. Thank you so much. Uh, so we give our members as much support as possible and link with the Actors Fund, with Career Transitions for Dancers, with Broadway Cares, so as often as we can. Uh, we now donate yearly to the Actors Fund because they have a new program called the Dancers Initiative by B.B. Newark. So we donate to them every year because they then give that money to dancers that in need. And that's what Zoya Laporska, one of our benefactors and founders, wants us to do. So we are doing that. Um, so when we, we participate in the Broadway Click Cares flea market every year. So Julie, when you have some old stuff from like, you know, Batman and stuff, we can use that, okay? <laughs> we can sell that. Um, good, good. Um, 
Current transitions, you know, helps people, help dancers move into other fields, and the Actors Fund supports dancers, and you know, if they need housing and jobs and counseling. But we sort of nurture their souls, and you know, because no matter what occupation, what you do, once a dancer, always a dancer. And you know, we we're here to build a community of dancers where all dancers feel comfortable, and where they can not only survive but thrive. So I could not be more proud to lead this organization than I am today. I, mean, I look out at all the members and their accomplishments in wonder and awe. I'm extremely proud to be associated with such a wonderful family of artists. So thank you so much to everybody here. Liza, Carol, Tia, Harvey. Everybody out. Please go bow. Everybody on the panelists. The last clip and out. All the panelists. Come on out. Thank you.